Hey guys. You know, I thought I'd come on here and kind of do a video, kind of explain something that I'm pretty sure anybody that goes on YouTube or or Vimo or or Daily Motion or wherever kind of wonders a little bit. You know, I know there's a lot of people that realize there's a huge fan base when it comes to MLP FIM, My Little Pony Friendship is Magic. But the one thing that a lot of people probably hear, the one word or the three initials, three letters that I get associated sometimes with fans exemplifying and kind of expressing the love for the show is PMV. So like I was saying, you know, three letters that sometimes get associated, that people will hear when they hear, when they see and hear fans expressing um, their love uh, for the show is PMV. Now, a lot of people wonder what PMV stands for. Well, if you are of the artistic side, then you know what AMV stands for. AMV stands for either animated or anime or animated slash anime music video. It's either animated music video or anime music video. Either way, its initials are A and B. Now, the reason I bring that up is sometimes people don't even acknowledge them as A and B. Sometimes they'll acknowledge them as fan vids, which basically is short for fan video. You know, FM, sometimes FMV, fan music video. Or just fan vid, like I said. And sometimes fan vid is associated with mostly uh, music videos that are comprised uh, of just like pictures from comics and, and stuff and, and artwork. Expressing the love for that, for that franchise or the characters or whatever. And sometimes there's even CMV or CBMV, which is short for comic music video or comic book music video. Any one of them. And, and one thing that, and what I'm trying to say is, when you hear about, so when you hear the words PMV, PMV are, is short for Pony Music Video. This is a term that got created when the show, when Friendship is Magic took off and became the phenomenon it is, and thus a name was, <coughs> a name was needed to associate with it if fans wanted to express the love for the characters and for the show through some kind of uh, visual media means and PMV was born. I don't know when the first PMV was, but basically PMV was born. You ba basically they took the A um, out of animated or anime music videos and put Pony instead, so there you go. You know, this is why when you, let, let's say you watch uh, Bronies React with people like AC Race Best and all that, and they're commentating on, let's say, episode 100, Slice of Life, you know, you'll hear someone like AC say, um, now there's a, now this scene with, let's say, Octavia Melody and Vinyl Scratch slash DJ Pone 3, is looking more like a PMV because that's literally what that scene was or kind of represented uh, looked like to them 
But a pony music video. Sorry about that. That was a kid in the background. But like I said, a, a PMV is basically that's is basically that way. It is an expression of it's a fan's expression of how much they love the show and certain characters. Most times, PMVs will be used to kind of uh, support, if not push, and if not send the message of certain romantic ships that fans want to see happen or fans feel need to happen or should happen. One of the most popular PMVs, if you look on YouTube, when it comes to shipping uh, certain characters, believe it or not, is Spike and Rarity. I mean, there is not, I mean, I put in Spike and, I could hashtag Spike and Rarity, Sparity, PMV, and there is not one PMV that even if I put Pony Music Video or PMV, that I did not see Spike and Rar a Spike and Rarity video. So, yeah, fans, fans like myself will actually use PMVs uh, to show our support and believe, and our support and push for this moment between the two characters to become official. This, this deal, this whole romance, shipping, whatever you want to call it, to become official. We will push for that. Sometimes, just like with any other shows, like what I've done, sometimes fans will take some heroic moments or epic moments from, let's say, two parters, two part premieres, finales, uh, certain episodes. And they'll apply what they feel is epic, heroic music. Like, recently I used Skillet's Hero, uh, the band Skillet. Um, the band Skillet, I recently used this song Hero from the album Awake. And I used it uh, for a pony music video. And people loved it. Um, I recently, about a couple months ago, did The Touch. I used The Touch by Stan Bush from Transformers in two different versions and two different kind of My Little Pony videos. Well, basically they were the same video, except the second time it was slightly modified to replace certain uh, repeated scenes with scenes that I had, that some people had suggested and I utilized and I used as part of that suggestion. So, Basically, and I gotta get into, back into work, guys. But, but basically, in the long run, that's what a PMV is. What a pony, a pony music video is. It's essentially just the Bronies and Pegasus Sisters, Rift Cafe, a uh, overall fandom's uh, version of AMVs, animated slash anime music videos, or fan vids, or. CBM or CMVs, comic music videos, or CBMVs, uh, comic, you know, like CMVs, comic music videos, CBMVs, comic, you know, comic book music videos. I know I said that twice, I do apologize, but you get what I'm saying. Comic music videos, comic book music videos. Anyway, it's just, you know, just a, a fan's way of expressing their love for something and PMV short for pony music video is the My Little Pony Friendship is Magic and even the Equestria Girls um, fan base of bronies, Pegasus sisters, you know, just expressing their their love and their their joy and a support for a show and its spin-off because they want they want it to succeed or they want it to be remembered for the pop culture phenomenon it's become. And sometimes, like I said, they even use PMVs to create moments, to do videos that are based around epic moments, heroic moments. And sometimes they use it to support, if not push, uh, their ideas for certain ships, romantic ships to take place. And like I said, the one I see the most at times is, is videos on Spike and Rarity. I mean, I did two just two days in a, in a row. Uh, I did one with the song I Just Seen a Face um, from uh, the Beatles. 
uh, which is a song by the Beatles, which is sang in the movie Across the Universe from 2007. Um, as well as um, yesterday, before I went to bed, I did a music video called Hook, Line, and Sinker, which is a song by Mark Nelsler, Nels Nelsler who voiced, who did the singing and uh, acting, who did the voice and singing voice of Tom Sawyer in the MGM 2000 animated film. And I had used Hook, Line, and Sinker before, and people actually enjoyed it. They actually liked it, you know, in a uh, AMV that I did for Rescue Rangers. But overall, what I'm trying to say, guys, is basically, for those wondering what a PMV is, the, you know, that is what a PMV is. It is basically short for Pony Music Video, and it's just the fandom's way, the Bronies and the Pegasus' way of expressing how they feel about, you know, expressing their love for the show, for characters, for romantic ships, you name it. So... Uh, that's all I'm going to say on it, guys. i got to get back into work now, so let me know what you all think down below. Comment if you like, and I will talk to you all later. Hopefully, this helped out in getting, you, getting some of you that may be wondering what PMV stands for a better understanding of it. But until then, until next time, guys, or until later, God bless, take care, I am out.